It feels like they should've put a ring on it. It feels like they should've put a ring on it. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Hey guys, I'm back again with a bomb tutorial regarding like <laughs> the intro already said it. <laughs> Put a ring on it, but yeah, I'm talking about my nails. And hopefully you guys like this tutorial. I'm going to show you guys how I did my own acrylic set, full set, and hopefully you guys like this tutorial and let me know are you guys feeling it? Are you feeling it? Like is it giving you mm, mm. <laughs> in this video you will see the products that i will be using today as you can see i will be using the mia secret acrylic system i'm using alpha brushes number eight and drill bits that i got from amazon the harmony secure glue acrylic from the your regular hair store and a no wipe gel top the, E Fowler that I got from Amazon and most of these products that you see in these video in this video were bought from Amazon as you can see now I'm buffing my nails to take off all the natural oils that are on my nails now I'm filing my cuticles to basically push it back a little I will be using the gelish bond pH bond nail dehydrator to basically take off all the oils that are on my nails and also currently right now you'll see me basically measuring the tips to see which one fits each finger I'm using this nail clipper that I got from Amazon to clip off the tips because I didn't want it too long. I just want it just, you know, average. I'm using the e-fowler to get the shape that I want, which is the coffin shape. And you will see me go over the nails just to smooth down the tip in my natural nail so it blends in well. As you can see right here, I am blending the tip with my natural nail. I am now using the nail filer to basically get everything to the specific shape how I want it and everything sharp and you know nice I'll be using the Mia Secret Cover Pink and also the Mia Secret Clear and their white acrylic powder to do the designs that I want to do today As you can see right here, I am trying to do the baby boomer or other, what other people call it, which is the ombre effect, where, you know, the tips are white and at my cuticle, it's like a nude. I am in love with this design and to get this design basically you need to dip your brush into the monomer and then dip your brush into the clear powder and do not take a lot of clear powder you will need to then dip your brush with the clear powder on it into the glitter to get that specific look
so I decided to make my ring finger like just full glitter the whole nail glitter and it actually came out nice and I love it As for my pinky finger, I decided to do it the basic pink color instead of doing any type of designs on it. I am now using the cover pink color to do the ombre effect on my index finger and also my thumb. After completing your design, you will then need to encapsulate your design with the clear acrylic powder. You will then need to file your nail to make sure that the shape is nice and sharp and also get near your cuticle area to make sure that there is no acrylic on your skin so your nail does not lift. And also just to make sure your nails are smooth and nice. After applying the no wipe gel nail top nail polish. I then left my hand in the UV lamp for 30 seconds. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video if you are in love with my nails and let me know down below in the comments on how well did I do my nails.